In this video, I want to show you how to create an outline for your research report, dissertation, or thesis, depending on the terminology used. Now, in your chapter one of your thesis, you'll have the introduction. And in this chapter, you can add a section called outline of this thesis. I've already created a figure label here called outline of the thesis. And here you can insert a figure showing all the chapters that's included in this thesis. Now this section is really nice for the reader just to have an overview of all the chapters included or information or what to expect when reading this thesis. So if you want to insert a figure, you can go to the insert tab, click on smart art, find the processes, and here you can find ready-made smart art graphics that you can insert. Now just be on the lookout, some of these smart art um, figures won't allow you to add an unlimited number of shapes. But say we choose this one. Now here you can change what you want it to look like. Change the colors. Let's say we want it like this. And here we can type in chapter 1 production chapter 2 so you can have an outline of your whole thesis in this this figure and then if you want to add a shape you right click and you click on add shape add shape after add shape add shape after and in this way you can include more shapes. Now here in the text you can now have a, a description of all the chapters and briefly state what is included in each of the chapters. If you don't want to do it this way you can always do it manually and create your figure manually. Go to insert, text box, here's your text box. Uh, insert again because we need an arrow, shapes. Here are your shapes. You can add an arrow. Of course, the, the style of the arrow can be changed. So you want it like this. Many other options as well. Click on your text box, right click, copy, and paste. And in this way, you can build your own graphic or your own figure. I hope this helped. I think it's a lovely addition to a thesis. If you found this video helpful, smash the like button. For more useful tips to boost your research experience, subscribe to my channel by clicking the subscribe button below this video. If you need a solution to a challenge not yet covered on my channel, leave a comment in the box below. See you in the next video.